Oh my god, is it the show? No. <laughs> Did we oversleep? I don't know. This is either this is either a disaster or a nightmare because exactly. I'm waking up next to you. Uh, but anyway. Uh, welcome to the Kate and Kurt show. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> We're here at Baker's Furniture. I think I'm blushing. <laughs> Am I? I'm usually pretty pale. You startled me. I was yeah. in a deep sleep here yeah. because of this beautiful bed. Yes, right. Very comfortable. But well, we're here for this furniture. Yes, uh, John Rossi, if you show us around, you want to check that out? We'd love to. The University Operating since 1808? It has almost. Been almost. It looks pretty operated. much. Maybe. Yeah, in the 50s, in the 50s, the store actually went into probate. All the okay. Baker family became yeah. deceased. Okay. And for a short period of time, there was actually no um, no running of the actual mm -hmm. furniture store at all. It just stayed in probate. Mm -hmm. So it was bought out of probate. By Stafford locals, uh, the people that bought it were a series of different partnerships until uh, my father ended up with his part of the partnership, and then my grandfather bought the other half um, and became solely family business at that point in time. That's great. Now, you got a lot of great stuff here. Can we go check it out? Let's do it. All right. All right, Tom, we're up here in the bed area. Um, so what do, you, what do you have for beds up here? Well, what we have, uh, which is very interesting, is a completely handmade uh, bedding line. The bedding line is, is a company called Schiffman. Schiffman's made in New Jersey. The uh, original um, company owner's name was Schiffman. They created this absolutely marvelous mattress. Uh, this It's now owned by a uh, Bill and Mike Hammer. Uh, another family business, and they put this bedding together exactly as it would have been done 30 years ago and prior. So they have what they call a, a box spring, which is eight-way hand-tied coils, and they have a mattress that has a minimum of four layers of cotton on each side. So it is a completely turnable, flippable mattress, two-sided, with an actual box spring. It's uh, it's really neat to have this old world technology versus all this new technology mm -hmm. that really isn't doesn't give you a lifespan. This bedding is good for 20 to 25 years of your oh. life. That's a long time in this world. Yeah, that's great. Let's go check out some couches. Just came from the bedding um, area, and I showed you the picture of the eight-way hand-tied coil springs. And interestingly yeah. enough, that's exactly the type of suspension that is in all of our upholstery. So all of our upholstery starts out in the same exact manner. There's coils inside each of these seat decks. So they're designed for longevity. They're, they're going to be with us until you wear the fabric off of them. Um, so you've got another 20 year experience possibly with a sofa that you get uh, from Baker's Furniture. We select these manufacturers purposely for their longevity and the, their tremendous um, upholstery methods mm -hmm. as, and um, durability and strength. And they're comfortable too. <laughs> and at the end, they're yeah. all comfortable. Yep. Exactly. That's great. Yeah. All right. Yep. So we're here in our curtain shop, um, still run by my mom, Pat. And uh, we try to keep all current and up to date styles. Come on down. You got beds, furniture, couches, everything you could ask. All quality products. So come down to Baker's Furniture and check it out. Yes. All right, thanks, John. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Middle Ground Cafe presents the first annual chili cook-off, and this is going to be Thursday, March 29th, 6 to 8 p.m. $10 entry fee. Winner receives a $50 Middle Ground Cafe gift certificate. Call to reserve your spot, 851-8900. And there's a $5 general admission fee, and that includes the judging rights, a sample of the chili, and a slice of homemade cornbread. Also, from Stained Glass Creations and Beyond, um, they are having a special all month long, and um, you can also see it on their Facebook page. And let's see here, March Madness Stained Glass Sale. From March 1st to March 31st, all stained glass, 10% off. Not valid on finished product or other supplies. Stop by the store and mention March Madness and get your 10% off. Nice. Okay, we are here at Baker's Furniture, just relaxing, taking a little snoozer. Talk, uh, talk about the weather. We should see temperatures in the low 50s to mid 50s through at least next uh, Thursday. Uh, and the skies will be uh, uh, 
Some days mostly sunny, some partly cloudy, but not bad at all. Uh, all this white stuff you see out there right now, psh, be gone by the weekend. Uh, Gulf weather is around us, and uh, we'll go for it. Nighttime temperatures, we shouldn't get below 30, so uh, there should be no problem there. Uh, you'll be seeing buds on the trees pretty soon, and uh, flowers popping up. Uh, That's great. So, um, yeah, things are looking really good here. And, uh, uh, and no, no heavy rain of any kind, storm any kind, in the forecast for at least seven to eight days. So plan what you got to plan and go for it. Everybody, have a good weekend. Enjoy the weather. Stay safe. Thanks, Saka. You're welcome. Kurt and I, this is why we're so tired, we went to the Pissardi Maple Farm. Yes. They were nice enough to let us come up there. So let's take a look at our tour. Yeah, let's check that out. Okay. All right, we're up here on in Potter School Road in uh, Willington. And we're at Pissardi Maple. We're going to go up. Not only do they have maple syrup, we're going to go through that in a minute. We're going to head on up and check out the bees because they also do honey here. So let's check it out. That's about, I'd say, uh, probably 30,000 bees in each one of those hives. 30,000? Yes. Oh, each? Yes. Oh See, God. the bees right now, they're, they're, they're not completely dormant, but they're like a, almost a dormant stage. Yeah. And they all cluster up and they keep moving. In other words, the inner bees move to the outside and yeah. keep moving like that. That's how they keep warm for the winter. Wow. wow. This line here just goes up probably uh, six trees, six or eight trees. Wow. With that one there, they probably got 20 trees on it. Amazing. Then it all goes in here. Yeah, and then we take the pump out of there, put it in the barrel and pump it out of here. They get the sap from the sun. It's just like the water. Now, if you were to taste it, it, it just a little bit of sweet water. We can put a teaspoon of sugar in a glass of water. That's, that's it. That's okay. what it tastes. Yeah. That was great. That was good I time. love maple syrup. So do I. So, um, get some birthdays. Would you like to do some? I would. Okay, today's birthdays are Les Cropley, Dan Weiskopf, um, later in the week, Alicia Carr, Amanda Tyrell, Todd Sheehan, and Melody DeGray from Stafford McKinney. Great, and I have Cindy Schaefer, Colleen Palumbo, Rob Butler, and Alex Ledger. Happy birthday to you all. Take a day and relax. All right. And um, is that it? That's it. Can I go back to bed now? Yeah, let's go back to sleep. Make sure you come check us out next week where we will be. I think we're going to be at the Near the Lake Cafe. I think so. Which sounds like fun. Okay. All right. Later. See you there. Night.